Hi guys, uh, this is another uh, benchmark uh, with the Palette uh, GTX 670 Jetstream 2GB. Um, I already have uh, two benchmark videos on YouTube, um, one being uh, Heaven Benchmark and also 3D Mark Vantage. Uh, 3D Mark Vantage, excuse me, 3D Mark 11. This is 3D Mark Vantage that I'm about to run. Um, now I would uh, run it straight on extreme preset but um, I don't actually currently have a 1200p monitor so I'm stuck with 1080p um, and I want the score at the end uh, sorry about the noise that is my lizard having a fit as I'm talking um, yeah so as I was saying uh, I'm going to do it on a higher preset because I want to score at the end uh, so I can't actually run uh, an extreme preset but. Um, here goes and nothing anyway. Uh, we're going to run a high preset and we're going to check out the scores at the end. I'm going to let this run through. Um, as I've mentioned on previous videos, um, I believe I've mentioned on previous videos, um, I've said that uh, I don't like recording with FRAP because you don't get a true score. And I also don't like uh, when people do benchmarks and just give you a graph a page full of graphs and numbers to look at. Um, I actually like to see, you know, the benchmark running. It's a bit more time consuming, but I enjoy uh, sitting there to watch the benchmark. Um, and even if you just want to skip straight to the end to see this, uh, the score that I'm given on a high preset, you're more than welcome to do that. But um, while it's running, you get a better gist of, you know, what to expect um, while it's actually. Uh, running. Any flickering and artifacts you see on the screen is nothing to do with the um graphics card overheating or anything to do with an overclock because it's at stock. Uh, for some reason this benchmark, even with all the latest updates, um, always has these flickery flashing artifacts, um, just the way that it's processed I'm guessing. Um, but it won't crash, it will run through. I tend to find if you run it on a performance um, which is uh, 1024 by uh, I'm not too sure what the performance resolution is, but it's 1024 by something. At that resolution, you don't seem to get these artifacts popping up. Um, but as I said before, it's nothing to do with instability of the card. Um, it's brand new. I've been running it for a few days now on games such as Crisis 2 and Battlefield 3, all maxed out, and it's not played up. It's been absolutely fine. I think that's the only scene where you get those. That's even if you saw them, you're probably sitting there, I don't even know what you're talking about. But during the um, Jane Nash bench, there's a sort of artifact in, but I think that's just to do with the, um, the way that the benchmark is generated. But um, you won't get any of those uh, on this specific scene. That noise you're hearing there is my dog, my dog flapping about like a lunatic, as well as a lizard scratching like a lunatic. I've said if he keeps flapping the way he keeps flapping, he'll take off one of these days.
Not too sure if you can see the uh, frame rate counter down the bottom there. I think uh, where that's quite bright compared to the uh, screen, it's probably blurred out. But regardless, at the end of the test, um, I'll go over with all of the scores. Uh, and if you wish to pause it at that screen to uh, compare results to other results you might have, feel free to do so. about halfway through this test now if anything it's about halfway through but these tests uh, seem to go pretty quick Apologise for any glare on the screen, uh, that's due to it being at uh, the time of day where the sun is on its way down and it's shining right through my window. So I do apologise about that. Okay, this is the last test. Right, let's see what we've got here then. Okay, uh, so this was on a high uh, preset. Uh, so there we go, we've got a, a high score of 26,930 uh, which I'm, I would say is, re is pretty high compared to uh, what I've seen that in the past on my previous cards I've had. Uh, we've got a GPU score there of 24,182 a CPU score of 75,629 um, 
So if we're going to go down uh, the list here, uh, as I said before, feel free to pause so you can compare, etc. Uh, we've got GPU test 1 and 2. Uh, as you can see, we've got 74.7 frames, 66.84. Uh, CPU test, uh, that would be the one with all the planes flying around everywhere, is uh, 3,121.65. CPU test 2, 284.64. Now a lot of people are going to complain about that because that wasn't running on my CPU, that was um, on the GPU physics test, so I mean you can scrap that if you want. Uh, and as you can see, all of the feature tests are there and you can see the scores um, so yeah that pretty much wraps that up so that's three benchmarks on uh, the GTX 670 uh, Palette Jetstream so that's a Heaven Done and a 3D Mark 11 and a 3D Mark Vantage um, any other benchmarks that um, uh, you would like or to uh, to see on this card uh, just post in the comments below and I will do my best to um, get those videos up um, but also now that the benchmark videos are done I can actually um, get some uh, gameplay uh, recorded and uh, I'll post you performance of um, some of the latest games available um, as usual thanks for watching and um, yeah, peace and out.